do on their website and come join us for a fun, friendly FNM environment. Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Slots Productions and welcome back to yet another Magic the Gathering gameplay. For this match we have Austin playing Mono White Weenies and he's going up against Andrew Shrout who's playing what I would call a red-green aggro slash mid-range deck. Austin was on the play for this game and started it off by playing a Soldier of the Pantheon, then Shrout just played a Stomping Ground tap. Austin played a Mutavolt and followed it up with an Imposing Sovereign, then he attacked with his Soldier, taking Shrout to 18. Shrout played a Sylvan Caryatid, however it entered the battlefield tapped due to the Imposing Sovereign. This left Austin open to animate his Mutavolt and attack with the team for another 6 damage, taking Shrout down to 12. He then played a Dryad Militant before finishing his turn. Shrout then summoned a Chandra Pyromaster and used her plus ability to do 1 damage to Austin and kill his Imposing Sovereign. Austin then animated his Mutavolt again and attacked with the team. He sent them all at Shrout for another 6 damage, dropping him down to 6. He then laid down a second Mutavolt and passed the turn. Shrout used his Chandra to ping Austin again and took out his Soldier of Pantheon this time. Shrout then played a Colonian Tusker and followed it up with a Reverent Hunter who entered the battlefield with 4 plus 1 plus 1 counters due to the Devotion. Austin laid down a Temple of Triumph and used it to scry. He chose to move the card to the bottom of the library. He then decided to go ahead and animate both his Mutavolts and attack with the team again. So Shrout just blocked the two Mutavolts killing them and then took the 2 damage from the Dryad going down to 4. Shrout killed the Dryad with his Chandra and took Austin down to 17. He then summoned a Xeno Ghost, the Reveler, and followed it up with a second Caryatid. He then made a Seder with his Xeno Ghost and sent his attackers to the red zone for 10 damage, dropping Austin down to 7. Austin then flipped over his top card, which was only a Brave the Elements, and with only two lands in his hand, he scooped it up, taking them to game 2. So that's it for this gameplay. I hope you all enjoyed it. You can check the annotations out at the end to find a link to the full gameplay, as well as links to my vlog and my Let's Play Duels of the Planeswalkers 2013. If you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and possibly add it to your favorites. Then subscribe and be sure to come back for more Magic the Gathering gameplays.